Are you the artist? I am. Very I'm cool. Judith Modrak. So what, what is this that we're looking at? This is a collective memorial piece called Our Memories. And the idea is for you to recall a powerful memory and then to deposit that memory into one of the empty sculptures. And so as the day goes by, the sculptures will fill up with more and more memories of everyone that wanders through the Nomberg Van Show. Hi, my name's Cavell. I'm from Louisiana. I chose the Stone of Joy because I've been going through a lot of anxiety and depression and like just looking at the nature and like my will to live and just like all the things around me and like what makes me happy and just like it helped me through a lot. My family and my friends and my theater group has um, helped me find some joy in my life and traveling of course, so that's why I picked Joy. My name is Leah Mae McMorrin. I was married to my husband for almost 63 years. He was my darling and I was his darling for all those years. I've always loved romance, love, and love, love, love is my theme, definitely, love. So what does this installation represent to you? Well, Our Memories is part of an evolving series of sculptures that analyze and reflect on the mechanism of memory. When I was thinking of creating an audience participatory interactive piece, I wanted to do something that would activate the memory function, but also collectively and physiologically create a memory for all the people that were engaged with it. The idea for it is to create collective memorial pieces that contain memories and experiences from people all over the world. My name's Jen and I chose fear because I think going to college I was very afraid but life's about overcoming your fears so yeah. I'm Colin and I picked the Stone Joy. Uh, we've been together for 10 years this year and this stone represents how I feel every day just being with this one. So where do you think your work is going? Well, after this installation in Central Park, mm -hmm. the sculptures will go downtown to a park called Thomas Paine Park, and then they'll stay there for 10 months. And then after that, the project is moving to New Mexico, hopefully to Maryland. They're talking to people in Ireland and Hong Kong. So the idea would be to take the project all over the world.